right, we are. All right, we are back. We are back. Okay. I just had to go and get myself. I had to let that finish up. All right. Uh, so what I'm saying. Oh yeah. All right. How many times do I gotta tell you? We blocked this off. You won't even find a cat on this street. I told you I've already contacted the police about this matter. What? Uh, uh, I'm not getting anywhere with my English. You sound like you're doing pretty fine, sir. Are you Chinese? Uh, no, I'm Japanese. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna read that. <laughs> I'm not gonna fucking read that. Oh yes, can you speak Japanese? Uh, yeah. Okay. Anybody who can read Japanese can I have an idea of reading this. Actually, I'm just gonna type it in for myself. So when I when I get the chance. <laughs> I am Kunihiko Kunihiko Maeda. Or Japanese, or, uh... Hey, if you can't speak the language, go back to your country. <laughs> Calm down. Take it easy, man. It's bad for your... It's bad for your heart. Bad for your heart. I'm getting out! Ah! Now or never. Spontaneous super combustion. I believe that's correct. Oh, I guess I didn't have a uh, fire extinguisher on at, at the hand right about now, so. <laughs> What the fuck? I still don't know what this is, though. A reception hall? It must be a reception to a hospital. <laughs> Where? <sighs> oh my god. I hope I can just kill this cold. Before I get- before I go to work on Wednesday. Hospital in red. <coughs> oh, my God. I'm actually grateful I'm getting this crap all done with right about now, so. Oh, what am I doing in this crappy, <laughs> crappy building, apartment building? Oh, you're finally awake. Lots of crazy stuff. Oh yeah, just so you know, this will be a bunch of cutscenes, so won't be much. Uh, but there will be some looting a little later. But you know, we'll get right. In, but then there'll be cutscenes after that. So, <laughs> who, who are you? I'm Kunihiko Maeda. I'm a scientist from Japan. He found you. Daniel. There's no one out there but cops. It's a ghost town. Never seen anything like it. Pretty creepy if you ask me. Where's Eve? What, what happened to the people in Central Park? Ben was okay, but the rest of the audience, well, they just disappeared. Disappeared? You mean they weren't ignited? They all melted into slime and became one big mass. That's something new. Nothing like that happened in Japan. Japan? A similar incident occurred several years ago in Japan, although it wasn't as grandiose as the, in scale as this one. I'm pretty sure it's referring to the book. <laughs> what? 
Hey, give us the details. It all started when a scientist's wife was involved in a car accident. And the scientist tried to culture her liver cells in order to keep her alive. And the scientist named those cells Eve. Eve? The liver cells multiplied and her mitochondria eventually took over her physical body. <laughs> After acquiring the scientist's sperm, Eve tried to give birth to the ultimate being. Ultimate being? What kind of being? She, the being who mutated from the liver cells, couldn't maintain her body for long. By the way, before the car accident occurred, the wife had registered to have her organs donated. So after the accident, her kidneys were transplanted into a young girl. Eve implanted a fertilized egg in the young girl and gave birth to an ultimate being. I was extremely interested in this and went to his lab so that I could continue research. And after hearing about this incident, I had to fly over here. What the hell is going on here? I wish I could explain more. I gotta remember that the next one. <laughs> this is starting to go a little freaky. Even on the third time. I are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I thought that monster had gotten a hold of you. Thought it was too late. When I felt Eve, something inside of me felt like it was being. You felt you were about to be ignited, correct? Nah, she's... well, she's the only one that isn't affected. What? I... I don't understand. I think I may be a monster. Like her. What? What are you saying, Aya? I don't know. What if... What if I end up killing you? Ah, shut up. You know that's not... Please, Daniel, I don't know. I just... I just don't know anymore. Please go away. Just, just stay away from me. Aya. Please. Yes, I understand your point. Hey, where do you think you're going? Oh my god, my nose is killing me right now. It's dying. Even if I am a monster, I don't ever want to kill you, Daniel. Please. I can never forgive myself if I killed you. Excuse me. Aya, you're no monster. You're my best partner, I, I, I Bria. I'll be by your side, always, Aya. Alright, that could... And so we begin. Oh, wait, never mind. Oh, that was it? Wait, that was it? Oh, wait, never mind. When I touched Eve, that feeling. Was it Maya? I'm guessing Maya is the other girl in the uh, other dead spread. But Maya died in a car crash with Mom. No, it just couldn't be. It probably is. Probably is, probably is. Oh, no. So we'll just find out. Later on in the game. Uh, excuse me. Day three, selection. Would you like to save your progress? No, I don't want to save right now. So. God, I'm dying here. Oh my 
like, oh, great, now I got the hiccups. <clears throat> great, now I got the hiccups. Fuck. It's just great. <laughs> All right. All right, let's just uh, get on with this. All right, let's see if there's anything in here. Okay, well, I do got it. Okay. Well, there is this. 30 ammo. That's the best. That's like the best thing I've ever had. Mm, best present I could ever get. So right now, we are in Soho. Right now, so. <laughs> and, yeah. That was, that was a long night. Sleep well? You were here all night? I told you to go away. I could have died. You could have died, you know. Why am I... God, I'm messing up everything. <laughs> uh, scientists don't believe anything without proof. It's, it's just one of those things. And besides... What? What? Oh, nothing. Okay, that was bizarre. That was very bizarre. Daniel? I mean, Daniel? No traffic. This is the way it ought to be around here. Daniel? So, what are we sitting around for? We've got work to do. Daniel, thanks. All right, we're gonna need some bigger weapons. There's a gun shop over there, let's stock up. Okay. I can't believe, I believe there's a pharmacy over there. All right, so apparently I have to. All right, after waking up beautiful Soho, head outside and meet up with Daniel and Mike. Before you can leave the area, you'll need to make two short stops. First, head to the west, to find a good shop, once you unlock the door, head inside, take everything you can. You can't pick up everything right now, leave some stuff behind and return for it once you clean it. Clean your inventory after visiting the gun shop. Head to the east to find your folks. Alright, let's head to the gun shop right about this. Right the fuck up. Out of the way, Aya. Daniel, no. Sorry, it's the only way. Dick. Thanks for almost taking my head off. <laughs> oh, wow. He just spins the gun like this freaking John Wick. Are you really a cop? Ah, we have, we think so, but we don't have a scientific proof, if that's what you're asking. We're in a time of need. Yeah. Okay, come on. Let's get our stuff. Gun. Come to daddy, your inventory is full. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, well, I better start using this stuff right about now, so. Actually.
Wow, it does have nice name tag regions. Nice. Nice. An M11. Mmm, guessing that's a. Well, it's apparently it's a machine gun. There's a club over there. your favorite accessories, ladies. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're going to be sticking to that old revolver. Well, no, well, you don't need to do that. This is just too much. <laughs> it's never, it's, it's never enough. Never too much. Yeah, I'm actually going to be doing an awful lot of uh, inventory management right now, like what I'm doing right now, so I'm going to check on the rain. Thank you. 